In Pennsylvania's state capital, hundreds of gun safety advocates rallying to demand what they call common sense gun legislation. Erie News Now state capital correspondent Brendan Scanlon was there. He's joining us live tonight to share their message. Good evening, Brendan. Eva, good evening. Yes, certainly a very emotional rally today as dozens of families and friends from around Pennsylvania gathered here at the Capitol to share some very tragic stories from gun violence. They say it is time to provide an emergency response to this crisis. Seven years old and we went back to life like business as usual. Not anymore. Not one more five-year-old, not one more seven-year-old. We need an emergency response today. Today, advocates like Daryl Craig and Kevin Stevenson with Erie Blue Coats traveled nearly 300 miles to Harrisburg. We promised that family that we would keep him alive in every push, every effort. Fighting for safer communities and remembering the lives lost to gun violence violence like seven-year-old Antonio Yarger of Erie. They called him ESPN and he was murdered just walking down the street on his way to his house. It is so senseless. It's impacted each and every blue coat that is standing here today. With gun violence as the number one cause of death for children, many say reform is overdue. Sensible gun laws work and every death that happens is preventable. Advocates want to see laws for safe storage requirements, enhanced background checks and more. But Republicans want to see the current laws enforced before creating new ones. Criminals are not going to just start following the law because you put new gun laws on the books. And on top of that, you have political prosecutors in our major cities who are not taking our already tough on crime law seriously. Advocates say children are more at risk every day that goes by without some type of emergency response. Every one of us should be losing our mind every time something like this happens and before the next one happens. Children are the responsibility of every adult in the world because we shape and mold the world that they're born into. And House Democratic lawmakers are optimistic about passing what they call common sense gun reform now that they have a majority in the House. However, in the Republican-controlled Senate, it will be a much more difficult task. Reporting live at the state capitol in Harrisburg for Erie News Now, I'm Brendan Scanland. Eva, back to you.